guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting during to episode 5 of Hori Mia. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Ugh, my that was crap. That thing is so fucking bright. I mean, it ain't bright bright, but oh my god. <laughs> Did you tie your hair? You look so cute. Mm. See, okay, I understand Claudia being like, yeah, let me go ahead and straight up text him. That's not right, though. I mean, uh, it's so awkward. And I get the fact that if, if she goes out to him and mm, yeah, it'd be awkward for her, but texting someone, that's a big no-no. I'm like, no, God, no. Mm-mm. No, I need to turn this off before this thing, like, dies on me. But she is going to have to talk to him. <laughs> oh. <laughs> a conversation like that <laughs> and then dude with the orange hair was there so yeah they have to be friends oh my god <laughs> Kyoko no I don't think easy me is like that. <sighs> no, like, mm -mm, no, easy me. No. Exactly. Just text them. Or you could call him. Go. 
Uh. No, it's just something completely different. <laughs> the girl who you're walking with. Don't lie. Chica? Oh, shit. <laughs> then what is it? Oh, damn. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Wait, kill goal. Mm. Possibly. I mean, because yeah, you haven't really called her by her first name. Bucks, bucks. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, shit. <laughs> Roxas, please stop, please. Do you know what that does to me? Oh my god. Your dad? Uh, okay. 
ain't no Kyosuke. I mean, he high, though. I know they're so pretty. <laughs> I remember she hits you with two books. long hair. No! Oh, it looks good on you though, but if you want to. My 
my heart. Oh my god. I thought they were gonna kiss. I I wonder if he cut his hair. No, I mean, it's nothing. You're the stereotypical body type most guys would go for. she left. Oh, Remy!
I can't. I can't. I can't. It's too much. It's too much. It's way too fucking much. Like, oh my fucking god. Jesus Christ. Uh -huh. My heart. Oh my god. The fact that he gets... He's over here. He gets over her and just like, oh shit, how are we gonna avoid this? But the fact is, in a way, even them holding hands, oh my god. I'm a mess. Oh my god, I can't. Uh, <laughs> her dad is fucking hot and hilarious. Like, oh my god. Mm -hmm. So yeah, give me a guy with like not long, long hair, but like shoulder length. Perfect. Going on to about Sakura. Oh my god, poor baby. I feel for her. She, you know what? I can't believe I'm going to say this. Me and her are very similar in that situation because, you know, honestly, as I said, Remy, Hori, um, Hori's friend, and then a couple other people, like I said, that is the typical, like, stereotype of what a guy normally is going to choose. They're going to choose the girl who is, um, like, skinny, but maybe has, like, a little teeny tiny bit of muscle on her, um, Finish, Cause that's like you know what's to you know what the our Hollywood has perceived the world has perceived and saying how you know like anyone who is like heavy or whatever isn't beautiful and much like that. Um, even like me, I have big boobs and big ass and shit like that, and um, I got curves and everything. Even though I'm also losing weight at the same time, but there are times where I feel like no guy is going to like me and stuff. More, they're going to look at my body and be like, mm, I don't give two fucks about her without actually getting to know my personality and such. I've had guys who've really, two boyfriends in my life as of now, who, um, mm, out of the two, I'll just say, one loved me for me and my personality and everything and also my body, but like, the other one, fuck that one. <laughs> fuck him. Even though we're kind of, we're kind of still friends, even though I haven't talked to him my kind of yeah months, months kind of years, but it is what it is with that. But I get how Sakura feels because you look at her and you look at someone like Remy or even Hori or even Hori's best friend, and as I said, those are the typical types of girls that guys will immediately. Um, be straight up into and immediately go for but with the fact that what's his face 
is possibly falling for Sakura at the same time, he he's taking a different chance. He's going a different route. And it's, it's like, okay, because I, I cannot believe I'm about to talk about this bullshit. Okay, so, <laughs> because I've also experienced this. I was watching, like, I was on TikTok one day, and I was just scrolling, and I saw this video. Okay, so it was a... A curvy girl very pretty curvy girl and such and she's pretending that she's at the club right and there's always that one asshole this all and this could be in high school this could be you know happened to you in your 20s whatever there's always that one asshole who says hey my guy likes you and you have all the rest of his friends all laugh and then the one who says that's into you is like uh hey nah man like i ain't, mm, i hate this guy so much like oh my god if you want to be an ass be an ass but like come on now like if i know what the fuck you're doing like mm -mm, i ain't gonna be stupid and play into it like i'm gonna look at you like you a dumbass and then i'm gonna be like no i ain't got that time for you i ain't got time for you i don't need that time to you know be made fun of or anything but then like let's say you know <laughs> a month to a year later you come out looking gorgeous as fuck and then the same guys try to do something if you didn't give me the time of day then why the fuck should i give you the time of day now that's the biggest thing and it still happens today but i mean how like you know going back to the show i mean yes they held hands walking home oh my god it was so fucking cute hell when she let go and he grabbed her i honestly thought he was gonna kiss her and be like oh my god we're really getting it we're getting it like ha but no <laughs> it would have been if they kissed in this episode i i, I would have died i would have been like help like, I'm falling and I can't get up. Please help me. Like, oh my god. But they're just so fucking cute together. And then, you know, she called him easy me. And she he was close to calling her Kyoko. But, of course, her, her dad stopped him. But I think the day that Izumi officially calls her by her first name, by Kyoko, I don't know. Something is going to tell me, something tells me that he's going to cut his hair first. And then that's when he's officially... I'm gonna start calling her Kyoko because I've seen pictures on Twitter of him with his short hair in the manga and he still looks gorgeous as fuck like oh my god like I can't like you know you hot as hell when you can rock a short or long hairstyle like I'm sorry like mm, god let me not bad boys <laughs> But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 5 of Honey Mia. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially, y'all, next Saturday for episode 6. Bye, guys.